today we're going to be playing a Roblox One Piece game called Vast Seas. I saw this game a while back, and I remember thinking when I saw this game, wow, <laughs> this game looks good. Now let me just say, this game of course isn't testing, you guys cannot play. What? Huh? What was that? Y'all want me to just get into the video like that? I bet. Now, first of all, the running animation in this game is pretty good. I'm not gonna lie. It's, uh, it's pretty good. But I noticed when you run for a good minute and you start really hard, it does like a little animation right there. That's pretty fire. Now, guys, currently in this testing, there's only one fruit, the mirror fruit. This is the one in my hand. It kind of looks like a, a seashell. This is the only fruit in testing, though, right now, the mirror, mirror, no me. Now, I would show you guys the animation for when you eat it. But I already ate it accidentally, so <laughs> can't show you that. Wait, you want to see my mirror abilities? Well, then you're going to have to watch further into the video because I'm going to... Uh, actually, never mind. <laughs> Wait, you want to see the mirror abilities? We're going to have to watch further into the video because I'm going to show those off later. First things first, let's check out the island because I'm not going to lie. Um, Yeah, that's like the first thing I like to do in any One Piece game. It's the moment of truth. <gasps> All right, I'm not gonna lie to y'all boys. I already knew this game looked visually good. Um, and it definitely does help that I have shaders. But like this game, and probably you guys can't really tell over the video, but this game looks really good. As you guys probably know already, for me in games, I like, I really like the adventure. I really like when the world looks good and when there's like stuff to do. I like exploration. Pretty much everything but PVP. I mean, PVP is cool, but ha, ah, look at this view. I ain't gonna lie, this island is a dub. All right, so I'm going to show you guys the first mirror skill because I actually want to get around the island faster. So, I mean, this is this is T, which is the flight move. I mean, I think this is the first skill. It's all at the top. Maybe it's the last skill. I like how the flight looks in this game, by the way. It's like, it's, it's, it's a flight. Like, look at this area over here. It's like, this is a whole vibe, bro. All right, let's climb this area and let's go to the next part. Ooh, all right. And this is like on the top of the mountain, on top of the hill. Yo, this feels like an adventure, bro. Like, if there's like story to this game, which I don't know if there will be, but if there was, they could really make it vibey, bro. Cause I'm getting, it's giving me a, some type of vibe. It's giving me some type of vibe. I'm not gonna lie. I'm gonna show you guys the Mera skills now, real quick. So, I already show you guys the flight. I'm gonna show you Flame Pillar, which is E. This is Flame Pillar. Oh, jeez, that AoE go crazy, but it looks really good. I like it. I like it. Let's use it again. All right, Crossfire. What's this? Oh, wow. You can, little, you can see the little rainbow effect, too. That's 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 fire. Fireflies. You already know what this is, pretty much. So you hold these abilities down, and it, it'll, it'll last longer. Fire Fist. We already know what this is, too. It's got a little fire animation as you hold it. Let go. Oh, actually, that was a lot quicker than I expected it to. And the AOE looked a little small. It looked more like a bullet. Let's try it again. Fire Fist. All right, all right. And last but not least, Flame Emperor. It, the moves in this game look so nice, though, visually. All right, let me throw it. Dang, that looks nice. I'm gonna lie, I'm gonna give the game a 10 out of 10 in terms of visual. I ain't gonna lie, the Devil Fruit abilities are fire. But this game actually looks like it would be like an adventure type game. It really looks like it'd be a story type game. And I wouldn't be, I wouldn't trip over it to be honest. Even though I'm pretty confident that's not the case. All right, enough of this blind roaming. Let's go check the Discord for some facts. All right, all right. So it says here in the Discord, there will be cutscenes. There'll be many PVP modes, treasure hunts, capture the flag, etc. Oh, nice to see. Is this a bandit beater? No, for example, there will be bar fights in Orange Town. Oh, just like Holy War X. Will fruits be easy to get? Ooh, y'all not gonna like this. Hard, 1% for legendaries. You guys are crying right now. All right, it's looking like in the first three months, it will cost 350 Robux then released to the public i'm pretty sure for free oh guess we're gonna have to see where this game goes but let me give out some free ideas real quick i think that they should make it where you could go inside every single building there should be some buildings where you could get items and and i don't know i don't know just make use of going inside each and every building i don't know if they had that planned already but you know also do not add gepo please <laughs> but yeah there should be something on you guys' screen now on your top right of the screen something should have popped up for you guys i think y'all should click that real quick or you're not going to be able to sleep tonight. 